Hi. You're watching Hexus TV and we're out here in Las Vegas for CS 2010 and uh, we're up in the very crowded Mad Cats booth and one of the reasons it's so crowded is because of this little baby here, this is an Eclipse keyboard and with me is Alex Very from Mad Cats who's going to tell us all about it. Alex, Thank away you go. Thank you Nick. Thank you Nick. Well, you know we've got a series of world firsts here at CS 2010 and this is yet another world first. This is our wireless light touch keyboard. This is the world's first wireless PC keyboard to feature a totally programmable LCD backlit media panel. So you can see that this keyboard's got uh, no numerical panel. Instead, we've got a little touch-sensitive touch screen here. And by using these little icons at the top, I can actually toggle between the numerical panel where it's on now. If I press this little button over here, that'll take me to my media uh, shortcut. So I can control my iTunes, or I can open up documents at a touch of a button. You see, I've got a little volume control here, and you can see what I'm doing. I'm just dragging the, uh, the volume up and down so I can can actually just drag my volume up or I can drag my volume down. I've got a little icon up here as well that says My Eclipse. Check this out. If I press the My Eclipse mode, you see I've got these little icons at the bottom here. Now I can program these icons to open up any number between one to three websites at a touch of a button. So if I press my gaming icon, I can open up hexus.com. If I uh, Press my uh, if I press my airplane icon, I can open up Expedia and say Travelocity all at the same time. It'll even open up an application for you at the same time. And and these little one to five buttons here, they're macros, so I can program them to do pretty much anything I want. Uh, I can also switch off my brightness for my backlighting. You can see that underneath here, I've got a trackball as well, so there's no need for an external mouse. Now the whole thing runs off an internal rechargeable lithium-ion battery, so there's no need for external batteries. It'll give you 20 hours of, uh, of playtime from each charge, and it comes of the desktop charger so it's really great if you like uh, to, uh, to to surf the internet on your home TV or if you've got like a home cinema PC set up as well perfect keyboard for you okay uh, one quick question seeing as you've answered all of my questions in that, in that one go there um, first off when's it available and how much is it going to be okay so this is going to be available in March uh, so the wireless light touch uh, in terms of dollars is going to be 129.99 uh, we haven't got a UK price set for it just yet but uh, I'll be able to get that over to you pretty soon uh, we've also got another version which is the one over here which is pretty much the same thing, but this is a wired version, right. and it removes the mouse trackball, but it's still got the touch-sensitive media panel, and that's going to be $79.99, also released in time for the spring. Fantastic, there we go. And uh, one last thing, you, you said about rechargeable, does it come in like a desktop dock, or is it yeah, a cable that goes desktop in? desktop dock. So yeah. it's still usable when it's docked? Absolutely it is, yeah. Absolutely. Okay, fantastic. And uh, are you aiming this at sort of like you know the, the person using it in the lounge? Yeah, well, I mean, there's, you know, there's obviously nothing to stop you using it as your main desktop PC keyboard. In fact, that's exactly what I would do. But it, it really is perfect if you're using it in the lounge. You know, I myself actually have a, a home cinema PC set up. And at the moment, I'm using a big old clunky keyboard with a separate mouse. And uh, it doesn't look very aesthetically pleasing. So this will look fantastic in any living room environment or indeed any office environment. Fantastic. And uh, I saw you just pick up this little thing here. So what's this? Yeah, this is a companion piece, actually, to the Light Touch keyboard. This is something else that we've just announced here at CES. So uh, this is our brand new Eclipse Touch Mouse, which is uh, the world's first touch-sensitive mouse to feature gesture-based control, which is pretty extraordinary. So it's a Bluetooth mouse. It's uh, a full aluminium top with a soft-touch uh, elastomer finish below. What's really cool here is that we've got no uh, scroll wheel, so you've got a touch-sensitive panel instead of a control wheel, and that'll allow four-way scrolling, so you can go left and right, and you can go up and down as well. But what's really cool is that we've got gesture-based control built into here. So if I hold down my touch sensitive panel and move the mouse forward it'll open up Internet Explorer if I hold I was going to ask what do you mean by gesture control is it sort of like you know well, you can program your own squirreling around as well yeah and I mean I, I can press and hold that for instance and move it left to right and it'll close down whatever web page I'm on as well so uh -huh. it's a really intuitive mouse and again it just looks really really cool very aesthetically pleasing and great quality as well and how much is that going to be so this is going to be 59.99 and uh, this is going to be released this January are you not going to do it with the bundle with the with the with the keyboard no no, not at the moment. We've got no plans to do that at the moment. They're going to be separate items. Uh, okay, there you go. You gotta collect them all. <laughs> <laughs> it's Pokemon time. Yeah. All right. Okay, so Alex, thank you very much. Um, there you go. We've got. We've got. I mean, this is really quite nice. That is it's beautiful, isn't that it? Is, that is really quite nice. Just, uh, Stefan, just, just pop that in the bag. Pop that oh, in the bag. Come we'll be, on, now. we'll be fine. Come we'll be fine. Okay. We've talked right, about cool. this before. <laughs> all right. Uh, check back soon on Hastings TV, uh, where we'll be uh, doing a show for what it's like to be inside a Las Vegas jail. You've got to pay me for that, right?